As with any lifestyle change or physical exercise program, consult your physician before you begin your yoga practice. If you are pregnant, discuss your yoga practice with your yoga instructor. As your pregnancy progresses, you will need to modify or avoid certain poses. Move at your own pace and modify the poses as needed in order to maintain alignment and easy breathing in every pose. If you feel any discomfort, dizziness, or pain during your practice, either modify the pose so that you are comfortable or take a few moments to rest. It is very important that you listen to your body and practice yoga in the manner that is the safest and most comfortable for you. Namaste. Hello, my name is Satare. Today we are doing Kundalini Yoga for Healthy Bowel System. Sit cross-legged with your back straight. Rub palms of your hands together and bring them in the middle of your chest at your heart center. We start every practice of Kundalini Yoga by chanting this mantra three times. Ong Namo Gurudev Namo which means I bow to the divine wisdom to the teacher within and without. This mantra is used to connect us to the golden chain of the teachers, to center us in the higher self, and to spiritually guide us during the class. You can chant with me or just listen. This mantra is chanted in one exhale each time. So take a deep breath to start. Om Namo Gurudev Namo Om Namo Gurudev Namo Om Namo Gurudev Namo Now bring your hands down and we are going to practice a breathing exercise called whistle breath. So make an all with your lips. Breathe in through your lips making a whistle sound and breathe out through your nose. Keep your eyes closed and your back straight. Shoulders relaxed. This breathing exercise helps to increase your lung capacity and increasing your mind function, which helps you to be able to focus better and have a better memory. Okay, now come sit on your heels. Let's do some warm-up exercises together. Place your hands on your thighs and we're doing camel ride. So as you're breathing in, bring your chest forward and your shoulders back and in exhale, arch your back and bring your shoulders forward. Make sure that your pelvis is rocking forward and back during this exercise. Inhaling, coming forward, exhaling, going back. 
Do this as fast as you're comfortable. Now come sit on the floor and stretch your legs out. Your toes are pointing up. Keep your legs together. Inhale, bring your arms up. And as you're exhaling, bend forward and grab your toes with your fingers. Now move your body up and down. Inhaling, coming up. Exhaling, going down. Go down as far as is comfortable for you. Inhale, bring your arms up. Exhale, arms down. Now, come lie down on your stomach, hands under your shoulders and legs together. Inhale, bring your chest up, neck and head up. Exhale, come down. Keep going, inhaling, coming up into cobra and exhaling, coming down. Come up only as far as is comfortable for you. If your lower back hurts during this exercise, maybe you're coming up too far. Inhale up. Now exhale, come down slowly. Now push yourself up. Bring your buttocks on top of your heels, forehead to the floor. Stretch your arms forward and relax in the baby pose. Breathing normally. Now inhale and come up sitting on your heels. Exhale your breath and come sit on the floor and open your legs as wide as you can. Start walking your hands away from your body. Come bend forward as far as is comfortable for you. Keep your toes pointing up. If you can, bring your elbows to the floor. Stay in this position, breathing normally. Keep your back straight. Inhale, come up. Now bring your soles of your feet together. Grab your ankles with your hands. And in the butterfly pose, bring your knees up and down. Keep your back straight. Now exhale and come bend forward, bringing your forehead towards your feet. Come forward as far as is comfortable. Inhale, come up. Come sit cross-legged, bring your arms up and put your hands on your shoulders and start twisting to the left and right. Inhale, twisting to the left, exhale, twisting to the right. Inhale, come to the center, exhale, arms down. And now come stand up, getting ready for the first exercise of the set. Come stand up with your feet slightly wider than shoulders width apart. Bring the arms straight out to the sides, parallel to the ground, palms down. Bend forward from the waist. Twist toward the left side, bringing the right hand to the left foot and the left arm straight up in the back. Continue moving up and down on your left side. As you're inhaling, you come up. And as you're exhaling, you're bringing your right hand on top of your left foot. Now inhale and come up and switch to the opposite hand and foot and repeat. 
Inhaling as you come up and exhaling as you're bringing your left hand on top of your right foot. Inhale and come up. Now continue the same motion but alternating sides and pausing for 5 seconds as the hand touches the foot. And continue. Okay, now inhale up and as you're exhaling, first bring your right hand on top of your left foot. Stay down for 25 seconds, breathing normally. Inhale up, exhale. Now bring your left hand on top of your right foot and your right hand straight up. Inhale up, exhale, right hand on top of left foot. Inhale up, exhale, left hand on top of the right foot. Inhale up, and exhale, bring your arms down. Now inhale, arms up, exhale, bring your right hand on top of your left foot, your left hand straight up, and stay here, breathing normally. Hold your position. Inhale, come up. Exhale, bring your left hand on top of your right foot. Your right hand straight up. Stay down and breathe normally.
now inhale come up with your arms parallel to the floor exhale arms down now come lie down on your back and relax for a couple of minutes Now start slowly moving your hands, your feet, bring your arms up above your head, give yourself a good stretch and release the stretch. Now bring your knees up to your chest, wrap your arms around it, first rock to the left and right. And when you're ready, bring your hands behind your knees and start rocking forward and back. And now come up sitting and slowly come up standing. We are going to do side bends now. So stand up with your legs wide apart, arms parallel to the floor and palms down. Bend to the side from the waist, letting the right arm come down to the right side as the left arm comes up. Then come back to the original position and stretch down to the left side and then return to the original position. It takes you about six seconds per side. Inhaling as you come up to the original position and exhaling as you're bending to one side. Inhale, arms up, and exhale, bending to one side. Now bring your arms down. Again, inhale, arms up, and now start twisting to the left and right as you're keeping your arms parallel to the floor and palms facing down.
Remember that your neck and head follows your chest. Inhale, come to the original position. Exhale, arms down. Now come lie down on your back and relax. This is our final relaxation. So let your legs to fall apart and your arms are away from your body, palms facing up. Keep your eyes closed and release your body. Don't let your mind take you away, just breathe.
Now start bringing your attention back to the room. Move your hands, your feet. You can move them in circles. Now bring your legs together and arms up above your head. Take a deep breath. Give yourself a good stretch. Exhale, relax. Now bring your legs up and your arms up. Rub the soles of your feet and palms of your hands together to activate all the 72,000 nerve endings. Now bring your feet down and let's do a cat stretch, bending one knee at a time, bringing it to the floor to the opposite side. Okay, now bring your knees up, wrap your arms around it. First, you can rock to the left and right and when you're ready, bring your hands behind your knees and rock forward and back. Come up sitting when you're ready, getting ready for our meditation. We are doing meditation to conquer self-animosity. Sometimes we can be our greatest enemy. When we don't accept the reality of who we are, we might turn to self-destructive habits, activities or thoughts, and create some barriers in the way of our life and our success. This meditation helps to conquer the state of self-animosity and gives you the ability for constant consciousness in support of the core self. Relax the arms at the side and raise the forearms up and in towards the chest at the heart level. Keep your back straight. Draw the hands into fists and point the thumbs straight up towards the sky. Press the fists together so that the thumbs and fists are touching. The palms are towards each other. Fix the eyes at the tip of the nose. There is no mantra for this meditation. Only the sound of your breath. In this meditation, you inhale through the nose. Exhale completely through the mouth. Inhale deeply and smoothly through the mouth. And then exhale through the nose. Now inhale and stretch your arms up above your head. Keep the stretch position as you take three more deep breaths. Now bring your arms down. 
We end each class of Kundalini Yoga by chanting Sat Nam, which means I am truth. So bring palms of your hands together in the middle of your chest at your heart center. Take a deep breath. Sat Nam Sat Nam Have a great day.